Hello. In this video, we are going to discuss about uh, Hamiltonian function and uh, conservation of energy. First, we would like to discuss Hamiltonian function. Next, uh, we will go to discuss uh, conservation of energy. Consider a general Lagrangian of a system L is given by L is a function of generalized coordinate, generalized momentum and time. QK QK dot and time. The time derivative of L, I mean the total time derivative of Lagrangian is dl divided by dt equal to summation k partial derivative of l divided by partial derivative of generalized momentum sorry generalized coordinate and uh, q dot plus summation k partial derivative of Lagrangian divided by partial derivative of velocity and velocity double dash double dash this one not single dash okay plus dou L divided by dou T this is equation number one From Lagrangian equation, we have this is Lagrangian equation. d by dt dou l divided by dou q dot okay this is our Lagrangian equation if so i'm going to consider equation number two now substitute equation number two in equation number one so I would like to substitute here, right? This place. Summation k d by dt dot q k dot plus summation k partial derivative of l divided by velocity velocity double dash. i mean q double dash as in this so l divided by dot t now i'm going to rearrange this equation summation k d by dt so x dot i mean q dot qk dot dou l divided by dou q 
qk dot from these two terms right remaining term is partial derivative of l divided by partial derivative of t this is our equation number three but we know that momentum equal to do l divided do q dot hence equation number three can be written as d by dt so in this place of partial derivative of l divided by m what is p k okay p k so just i'm rearranging here d l divided by dt is there this l p q dot d by dt here also d by dt is there so it's better to write like this summation p k q dot minus l equal to minus do l divided by do t so don't confuse here i am using these two terms here again this term is the equation is here this term is separate okay the quantity in the bracket is called the hamiltonian function uh, which we denoted h the quantity in the brackets Hamiltonian function H that is H equal to summation K P K Q dot K minus L, L Lagrange. Okay. This is the Hamiltonian function. This is equation number four. In general, the Hamiltonian function H is a function of uh, generalized momentum, generalized coordinate, and time so we're going to write this uh, hamilton in h h is a function of uh, generalized coordinate generalized momentum not uh, velocities generalized momentum p k t therefore dh divided by dt equal to minus dl divided by dt this is equation number five if time t does not appear in a lagrangian explicitly then do l divided by do t equal to zero then this equation becomes dh divided by dt equal to 0 then h equal to constant h 
हेंस हेमल्टोन इन हेच इक्वल टू समेशन के आई मीन पी के मोमेंटम फ्यू डॉट एल इक्वल टू कॉन्स्टेंट सो दिस इज अवर लेग्रांज इन फंक्शन लेग्रांज इन इक्वेशन इज डिफरेंट लेग्रांज इन फंक्शन इज डिफरेंट ओके लेग्रांज इन फंक्शन इज हेच इज इक्वल टू पी क्यू डॉट माइनस एल so remember this statement here if the t does not depends i mean does not appear in lagrange in l explicitly and then this equation do l divided by dot is equal to 0 hence this equation number 5 is dh divided by dt is equal to 0 and h is equal to constant by this statement i am going to use here the h is equal to the i mean lagrange in function equal to constant when is lagrange in function is equal to constant Uh, if time t does not appear in the lagrangian explicitly then lagrangian function is constant this is lagrangian function and the next one is conservation of energy okay so the hamiltonian takes a special form if the system is conserved that means the potential energy v is independent of velocity coordinates and the transformation equation for coordinate does not contain time explicitly that means the coordinates are i equal to r i q1 comma q2 and so on qk and so on qa for conservative system for a conservative system do v divided by do q k dot equal to 0 then p k equal to do l divided by do q k dot i mean momentum conjugate conjugate momentum so therefore we can write t minus v divided by do q k dot that is equal to do t divided by do q k dot because do v divided by dot is equal to zero by substituting this equation in hamiltonian function this is the our hamiltonian function k p k q k dot minus l right so substitute in place of uh, conjugate momentum our value do t divided by do q k dot here also q k dot minus lagrange so we know that the kinetic energy t equal to 1 divided by 2 m q k dot square so i'm going to derive this equation with respect to q dot velocity you will get the m k q k dot because two to go into cancel now i'm going to multiply here then the equation q dot in both side of this equation let's see what happened m k Q K dot square. 
ஃபங்க்ஷன் So from this Lagrangian, we derive the uh, Hamiltonian function h is equal to p q dot minus l, and the final one we conclude is the conservation of energy.